Hi, this is Dr. Greg Oliver, and hello again from Fat Doctor TV. Today we're going to talk about the fat attack. Well, let me put this into some uh, context here. Uh, in the medical field, we talk about asthma attacks or gallbladder attacks, and those are sudden acute episodes of illness. Let's look at asthma attacks. That's where someone who has asthma, which is typically an allergic problem when they come across an allergen or something they're allergic to, their air tubes become inflamed in their lungs and tighten, and they have trouble breathing. And that's an asthma attack. That's a sudden episode that hits them. Well, what I tell a lot of our patients who are losing weight, when they lose weight and they get down toward their goal, that's exciting. But as we all know, almost every dietary program, including bariatric surgery, Patients will reach a plateau, they may reach their goal, and then your weight will go back up. Imagine that. That is what I call a fat attack. Now, what happens is we know that uh, there's a lot of factors involved in gaining weight, and it has to do with our uh, environment, it has to do with our genetics, it has to do with our biochemistry, it has to do with the environment, it has to do with the way our body's made, which is made to store fat uh, for the future. Our body prefers to burn carbohydrates and glucose over fat. So we are fat storing machines. We were created that way. So when a person loses weight, after they reach that goal, what happens is some of those same factors, the environment, their biochemistry in the brain, their genetics, they're still there. So what we tell our patients is once you've reached your goal weight, once you've gotten your weight down to that point where you need to be and you want to be, if you gain back 5% of your total body weight, so let's say your goal weight was 100 pounds, if you gain back 5 pounds, that's a fat attack, and you need to get serious about getting that 5 pounds off. If 200 pounds is your goal weight, and you gain back 10 pounds, that's a 5% gain in your weight. That's a fat attack. So anytime you gain more than 5% of your, of your uh, optimal body weight or your lean body weight, you are having a fat attack. Now, if, if you're overweight and you're maintaining, but suddenly you gain 5% of your, of your optimal body weight, you're having a fat attack and you need to take action. Just like someone with asthma would take action if they're not able to breathe, if you're having a fat attack, you need to take action. You need to see your doctor, get back on your program, start your exercise, and get serious about it. Sit down and write those goals and those step-by-step -step ways that you're going to drop that weight and block the fat attack. So what we do in our practice is we tell people, even if they're at their goal weight, their optimal weight, if you have a fat attack and gain 5% of that body weight back, we need to be hearing from you. You need to get in touch with us. You need to do whatever it takes to get that weight down, because if you don't, that fat attack is going to turn into a long-term fat attack. You're going to gain 10 pounds, 20 pounds, 40 pounds, 60 pounds, and go right back to where you were. And all the work, all the effort that you took to get down to your goal weight will be for naught. So watch out for the dreaded fat attack. That's it today from Fat Doctor TV. Dr. Greg Oliver saying goodbye, and watch out for that fat attack. Have a great day.